While some investors might be hesitant to invest in stocks because they have recently set new record highs, history has shown that the stock market could surprise investors by going even higher. Although it is impossible to predict when stock market corrections will start, how long they will last, or where the bottom will be, we do know that every downturn is eventually erased by a bull market rally. Investing in exceptional companies to position for these extended bull market rallies can make patient investors significantly wealthier. Even with the NASDAQ composite close to a record high as of this writing, growth stock bargains can still be found by opportunistic investors willing to seek them out. The first remarkable growth stock that is calling out to be bought as the new NASDAQ bull market gains momentum is the financial technology company Block. Although competition in the digital payment space is intensifying, Block's foundational operating segment and its expansion into digital payments are achieving their targets. This foundational operating segment is the company's Square ecosystem, which offers everything from point-of-sale solutions and data analytics to loans for businesses. During the March ended quarter, the Square ecosystem witnessed $50 billion and $500 million in gross purchase volume passing through its network, translating to $202 billion on an annual run rate basis. For context, Square generated less than $7 billion in full-year gross purchase volume in 2012. What makes the Square ecosystem such a promising cash flow driver is that its solutions are resonating with an increasingly larger merchant base. Since this is a transaction-driven platform, larger businesses are Block's gateway to higher gross profit. Another key platform for Block is the Cash App. This peer-to-peer -peer digital payments platform concluded March with 57 million transacting active users and a monetization rate that expanded by 7 basis points to 1.48% from the prior year period. A second unforgettable stock that investors will regret not adding to their portfolio as the Nasdaq embarks on a new bull market is the coffee chain Starbucks. Despite recently reporting what could arguably be regarded as its worst quarter in years, Starbucks enjoys undeniable competitive advantages that can benefit patient investors. To begin with the obvious, Starbucks has exceptionally strong pricing power. Regardless of how much labor or product-based inflation the company has faced, it has rarely encountered difficulty passing along the price increases to its loyal and expanding base of global customers. Perhaps the top selling point for Starbucks is its 32 million and 800,000 active United States rewards members as of the end of the fiscal second quarter. In exchange for a free drink or food item from time to time, rewards members typically have larger tickets, save their payment information on their smartphone, and utilize mobile ordering to their advantage. In essence, rewards members expedite lines and shorten wait times. Do not overlook the innovation Starbucks has consistently demonstrated over multiple decades. Although some of its newer drinks may not be resonating with consumers, its drive through ordering board revamp during the pandemic, coupled with its evolving food offerings, have helped the company sustain or increase its operating margin. Starbucks is also cheaper than it has been in a very long time, based on its forward price-to-earnings ratio. Its forward price-to-earnings of 19 is about 31% below its average forward earnings multiple over the last five years. A third distinctive growth stock that investors will regret not acquiring as the relatively new Nasdaq bull market finds its footing is the cybersecurity company Okta. While there has been some concern about Okta's valuation, following the admission of a security breach in October 2023, the company's operating performance has quelled those worries. One of the best aspects of cybersecurity is that it is no longer an optional service. Businesses of all sizes with an online or cloud-based presence need to protect their sensitive information from robots and hackers who are indifferent to whether the United States economy is thriving or struggling. As more data moves online and into the cloud, cybersecurity companies like Okta have enjoyed a steady increase in aggregate customers and subscription revenue. Okta's success in identity verification is based on its cloud-native artificial intelligence and machine learning. Although this service is not perfect, an artificial intelligence and machine learning powered platform should be more agile and considerably more efficient at identifying and responding to threats than on-premises solutions over time. In the company's April ended quarter, it recognized a subscription backlog of approximately $3,360,000,000 in cash, cash equivalents, and short-term investments. Since Okta is cash flow positive, management has no concerns about aggressively investing in new identity solutions. Meanwhile, its substantial backlog should yield predictable operating cash flow regardless of what happens with the United States economy over the next year. 
The fourth unforgettable growth stock that investors will regret not buying in the new Nasdaq bull market is none other than social media giant Meta Platforms. Despite Wall Street's lukewarm reaction to Meta raising its spending forecast, this industry leader has an extensive history of successful monetization efforts. The foundation for Meta continues to be its social media assets. It is the parent company of Facebook, the most visited social site globally. No other social media platform comes close to providing access to as many daily active users as Meta. This is a good time to mention that Meta benefits from disproportionately long periods of economic growth. While recessions are an unavoidable part of the economic cycle, they are resolved rather quickly. By comparison, a company like Meta, which generates almost 98% of its sales from advertising reaps the rewards of economic expansions lasting for years. Another reason to have confidence in the chief executive officer Mark Zuckerberg's company is its substantial financial reserves. Meta platforms ended March with over $58 billion in cash, cash equivalents, and marketable securities, and generated more than $76 billion in operating cash flow over the prior four quarters. The final piece of the puzzle is Meta's attractive valuation. Despite quintupling, since its bear market low of 2022, Meta still trades at less than 13 times the estimated cash flow for 2025. In summary, as the Nasdaq composite approaches new highs, investors still have the opportunity to find growth stock bargains. Block with its Square ecosystem and cash app, Starbucks with its strong pricing power and innovative approach, Okta with its essential cybersecurity services, and Meta platforms with its dominant social media presence and robust financial position, all represent remarkable investment opportunities in the current market environment. With that being said, press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video.